Have you ever wondered why hybrid cars are becoming more popular than electric vehicles? Well, it's a question that's been making rounds in the auto circles, and for good reason too. The rise of hybrid cars in recent years has been nothing short of phenomenal. Once considered a niche market, hybrids are now giving pure electric vehicles a run for their money. And it's not just about the sales numbers. The shift in preference towards hybrids is a complex interplay of factors, from range anxiety and charging infrastructure to cost effectiveness. But it's more than just that. It's about the changing attitudes towards sustainability, the evolving consumer preferences, and the relentless march of technology. In the next few minutes, we'll be exploring each of these factors in detail, giving you a comprehensive understanding of why hybrids are gaining the upper hand. So, buckle up and get ready for an enlightening ride. Stay tuned as we delve into the reasons behind the surging popularity of hybrid cars over electric vehicles. Before we dive into the reasons, let's understand the basic differences between hybrid cars and electric vehicles. In the simplest terms, a hybrid car is a fusion of a traditional petrol or diesel engine with an electric motor. The engine charges the electric motor, which can then take over and power the vehicle at lower speeds, or assist the engine when more power is needed, such as during acceleration. This combination allows hybrid cars to reduce fuel consumption and emit less carbon dioxide compared to conventional cars. On the other hand, electric vehicles, also known as EVs, run solely on electricity. They are powered by one or more electric motors, using energy stored in rechargeable batteries. There's no internal combustion engine, no fuel tank, and no exhaust emissions. Because of this, electric vehicles produce zero tailpipe emissions, making them a greener alternative. The main difference between these two lies in their power sources and functioning. While hybrid cars use a combination of an internal combustion engine and an electric motor, electric vehicles rely completely on electric power. This difference in power sources has a significant impact on the driving experience, range, and environmental impact of these vehicles. Hybrid cars offer the advantage of better fuel efficiency, especially in stop-and-go city traffic, and they can be refueled at any petrol station. Plus, they allow for longer trips without the need for frequent charging stops. Electric vehicles, while they produce zero emissions, require a charging infrastructure which is still developing. The range of an electric vehicle depends on the capacity of its battery, and while advancements are being made, most EVs still can't match the range of a hybrid or conventional car on a single charge. However, they offer a quieter, smoother drive and lower operating costs. Now that we understand the basics, we can explore why more and more people are choosing hybrid cars over electric vehicles. One of the main reasons people prefer hybrid cars is what we call range anxiety. But what exactly is range anxiety? Well, it's the fear that a vehicle has insufficient range to reach its destination and would thus strand the vehicle's occupants. This is a common concern for many potential electric car owners. The thought of running out of battery in the middle of nowhere without a charging station in sight can be quite daunting. Now, let's consider hybrid cars. These vehicles use two or more distinct types of power, such as an internal combustion engine to drive an electric generator that powers an electric motor. This setup means that when the battery runs low, the car doesn't stop. Instead, it switches to gasoline. With a hybrid, you are essentially carrying a built-in backup generator. This ability to switch power sources provides a safety net that eliminates the fear of range anxiety. It means you can take that extended road trip without constantly worrying about where the next charging station might be. You can enjoy the open road, knowing that if your battery indicator starts to dip, your car will seamlessly switch to its gasoline engine. So, with a hybrid car, you can travel long distances without worrying about running out of charge. You have the flexibility of an electric vehicle without the stress of being left stranded. It's the best of both worlds, and it's one of the main reasons why hybrids are surging in popularity over electric vehicles. Another reason is the current state of charging infrastructure. It's no secret that electric vehicles require a place to charge up, just like conventional cars need a petrol station. However, the availability of these charging stations is not as widespread as one might hope. Sure, metropolitan areas are seeing an increase in charging points, but what about more remote or rural areas? The lack of charging infrastructure here can be a significant roadblock for potential electric vehicle owners. Now let's compare this with hybrid cars. Hybrid vehicles have a unique advantage. They can run on both electricity and gasoline. This dual fuel system means that even if a charging station isn't within reach, a hybrid car can simply switch to its gasoline engine and continue the journey. 
The gasoline engine also recharges the battery while it's in use, further reducing the need for charging stations. In addition, the time it takes to charge an electric vehicle can be considerably longer than filling up a tank with petrol. While rapid charging technology is improving, it's still not at a point where it can compete with the convenience of a quick pit stop at a gas station. Consequently, the current state of charging infrastructure can discourage potential electric vehicle buyers. But with hybrid cars, this issue is significantly mitigated. Hybrid cars with their ability to run on gasoline are not as reliant on charging infrastructure, making them a more convenient choice for many. Hybrid cars also have a financial advantage over electric vehicles. Now, we're not just talking about the spare change you find in the couch cushions, LOL, laugh out loud. We're talking about a significant cost difference that can be a game changer for many potential car buyers. Let's look at the sticker price first. Electric vehicles, while undeniably cool, come with a high upfront cost. Sure, the price has been dropping over the years, but it's still a hefty investment. You're looking at tens of thousands of dollars for a new model. And that's before we even start talking about the cost of installing a home charging station if you want the convenience of charging your electric vehicle overnight. Hybrid cars, on the other hand, are typically priced lower than their all-electric counterparts. They come with a smaller battery and a gasoline engine, which makes them less expensive to manufacture, and consequently, less expensive for you to buy. But the financial benefits of hybrid cars don't stop there. Many countries offer incentives to encourage the purchase of hybrid vehicles. These incentives can take the form of tax credits, rebates, or even exemptions from certain fees. In the United States, for example, it is alleged that the federal government offers a tax credit of up to $7,500 for the purchase of a new hybrid vehicle. And many states throw in additional incentives on top of that. When you add up all these savings, the cost of owning a hybrid car can be significantly less than owning an electric vehicle. Not to mention hybrid cars also offer better fuel efficiency than conventional cars, so you'll continue to save money on fuel costs over the lifespan of the vehicle. So, for many people, hybrid cars are a more cost-effective choice. They offer a more affordable entry point into the world of green cars, without the high upfront cost and the ongoing charging costs of electric vehicles. Plus, with the added benefits of government incentives and improved fuel efficiency, it's clear to see why hybrids are a smart choice for your wallet. With these reasons in mind, it's clear why hybrid cars are surging in popularity over electric vehicles. In the grand scheme of things, the automotive world is undergoing a major shift. We've seen how hybrid cars, due to their ability to alleviate range anxiety, their compatibility with the existing charging infrastructure and their cost-effectiveness have become the popular choice over their all-electric counterparts. Let's recap. Range anxiety or the fear of running out of battery power before reaching a charging station is a significant concern for potential electric vehicle owners. Hybrid cars with their dual power sources provide a safety net, easing this anxiety. Moreover, the current charging infrastructure is more suited to hybrids. While electric vehicle charging stations are gradually increasing, they're still not as ubiquitous as traditional fuel stations. And lastly, hybrids, at least for now, are generally more cost-effective. They often have lower upfront costs and thanks to their fuel efficiency, can lead to savings in the long run. But what does the future hold for cars? It's a fascinating question. While hybrids are having their moment in the sun, it's important to note that they are, in essence, a bridge technology. They're a stepping stone on the path to a fully electric future. As battery technology improves, and as charging infrastructure expands, we can expect electric vehicles to become more prevalent. However, this transition won't happen overnight. It's a process that will take time, and during this transitional period, hybrid cars will continue to play a crucial role. They offer a practical solution for those who want to reduce their carbon footprint, but still need the reassurance of a petrol engine. In fact, some industry experts predict that hybrids will continue to dominate the market for the next 10 to 15 years. They believe that these vehicles will serve as the catalyst for change, paving the way for a full-scale acceptance of electric vehicles. While the future of cars may be electric, for now, it seems hybrid cars are leading the way. Whether you're a car enthusiast or an environmental advocate, it's an exciting time to be involved in the world of automobiles. The road ahead is clear. A greener, more sustainable future is on the horizon, 
and it appears that hybrid cars are driving us there. What do you think?